It really is, and it's going to be one of those races that both parties are putting a lot of time, a lot of money, a lot of energy into. Kendra Horn considered one of the most vulnerable members of Congress in the country. It was a race down to the wire last night. At times, Nice and Bice within 10 votes of each other, but by the end, Bice won with 53% of the vote. That's a 3,000 vote margin. Nice strong in the rural areas, Bice winning Oklahoma County. I look forward to working with all of you to take on Kendra Horn and Nova. Yeah. Even before now, both parties' congressional committees said they saw this race as a major target. Democrats want to hold on to this seat, and Republicans want it back after Kendra Horn shocked the state two years ago. She was the first Democrat to win this seat in more than 40 years. In 2018, a non-presidential year, Horn won the seat by a point and a half. A big question, will President Trump on the ballot this year give Bice a boost? And does Kendra Horn get a leg up now as an incumbent? And interesting to point out, of course, this is going to be a very expensive race. Kendra Horn with the fundraising edge at the moment, but of course the primary on the Republican side just now ending, and we're expecting to see a lot of outside money in this race too. We will continue to follow it all the way until November. In Oklahoma City, Dylan Richards, KOCO 5 News.